Today we're going to show you how to hook up a printer to the Sierra Wireless Aircard Hub. It's pretty simple as you can see. You just need a printer that has an Ethernet connection on it which you can then plug to the back of the hub or even Wi-Fi. You can see I've got my hub set up there. And then connect it to a laptop via the Aircard Hub to the printer. Now to start off, the Aircard Hub as it comes by default from the factory is set up for easy mode. That is like that. Over to Soho mode. So I'm going to do that now. The SSID of the hotspot has changed from what it was before to something dash C, and the dash C just indicates that it's now a different SSID in Soho mode. Now on the printer itself, you just need to make sure that you set up the printer so that the IP settings are set to automatic. Now it's different for every printer, but on this one, it's, uh, this is the way you do it. It's just a matter of plugging in the Ethernet cable into the back. There we go. Now, as you can see, the Aircut Hub now has all the LAN connections getting ready to go. On my laptop, because I changed the SSID, I now have to change over back to the new one. That's what just happens to be. Okay, so now it's just taking a while to sync up, won't be a moment. And I can see I've got internet connectivity once again. Just refresh the screen and you can see now that I'm in small office, home office mode. Now the beauty of that, is on the back here, means that the subnet on the back stays up even though you remove the hotspot. Let's have a look to see what IP address we've been given. Now we've been given a 192.168.2.86 which is about right. By just removing the device off the hub when you're running it in Soho mode it actually still stays on the same IP address, so you can still use it. So anything else connected in via the Ethernet ports at the back can be then still used with the printer. Okay, so now I'm going to put the hotspot back on. And so long as I've got the drivers already set up on my laptop, I should be able to then just wirelessly, and I am wirelessly connected to the hub, Print, the printer. So I'm going to do a test print. Let's do a test. I'm going to print. I printed this one here. Print one page. And there you have it. I hope this has been helpful for you and good luck with continuing to use your Sierra Wireless and Aircard Hub with Sierra Wireless Aircard 760S.